Thank you, thank you, Ramon Mishima. My name is Kipono Bet. I was elected to the member of parliament for the Department of Mathematics, Chemistry and Physics. As the MB, first of all, I could say, I've, I've been elected as the deputy speaker. That's one achievement. And I should not forget that uh, I'm the new father in the campus. That is one. That's an achievement I've made this year. Now, let me work on the report to my action plan. Following the changes the university made to, to my departments, we had to be to, put together, Department of Chemistry and Mathematics, and there was so much separation. So, as you talk now, it is a one department. We have, been, we have managed to seal the polls and it is now a one united department being headed by Professor Paul. Another thing is, when we got in the office, we didn't have a lot of things. And following those changes, we caught some things as advantages. We got now to share some of the computers, which at first they belong to one department, but now it is being used by all of the students. So that's an achievement. And another one is the club. We had two clubs, and now this is one department. So there was, it means that there must be one club unifying. So we uh, together with some other friends in service, we have formed another club, sorry, called uh, Applied Science Club, which is now an overall club covering uh, the whole department. Mm. First is uh, status quo. When I got into office, I thought things could work fast. Uh, with the spirit I got in there, I found things are not working as fast as I thought. Some people somewhere still believe that things are done in that way they know. So people others, other people are not ready for the changes. Mm -hmm. One, or well, sorry, the second one is the wasting management. We haven't been able to dispose the chemical use in the lab, so we store them and it is dangerous to them and firemen. <coughs> Three, now that it is a lab, we use chemicals, we have got students on work program, we work in those places. So I have not been able to <coughs> convince the university to consider the working environment for this. So you realize the university still pay them as the, the, the rest of the students who work in the cafeteria or any other place which are less dangerous. Mm -hmm. So that is a bigger challenge. I haven't been able to <coughs> To, to, to achieve alongside the rate, rate is still being paid as the rest. And at first, I thought I could convince the university that these are the students who work in their respective field could be considered as extra professionals, but that has not happened. Thank you. My advice would be that uh, as our challenges are new each day. As our circumstances are new each day, we must think anew, we must act anew, we must increase or we must bring broader ideas, we must collaborate and we must create friendship in the environment we are working. Otherwise, this thing will not be possible if one person is going to work. It is a teamwork that when you get involved with the first thing, Find the people you can work together and put a trust among all of you. Thank you.